hello guys you're welcome back to my channel so today i want to be making sakpa or your rice <laughs> nigerians will know when i say sakpa sakpa all right let me put the meaning on the screen so guys this is the rice i'll be using i'm just doing a one time um rice like a one time meal for me and my hobby and then my little baby she has started eating family foods with us but it is it is not really her main meals like meals that she would eat and to fill her up so this is the rice i'll be using i'm about to boil and this is the fish i'm soaking it in hot water you can see the smoke coming out i'm soaking the fish it has been in my kitchen so i just had to break it and soak it in hot water before i wash it and then this is the red oil that i'll be using is a very like a natural it gives my soup a very good taste and i know it's going to give this rice a good taste as well and then of course this is my salt and then this is the seasoning that we're using now then we're using this tree pepper and then my onion what else all right i think i'm not using any spices it's it's actually a supper on your rice so guys let's go the first thing is for me to parboil this rice so let's go guys so let me quickly slice the onion guys my tripod is bad so i'm actually using my hand to do the entire filming so let me slice the onions now so guys, let me filter out the fish now and wash it. So this is the first water I used in soaking it with hot water because the fish said is very strong. So at least this soaking now and by the time I will be cooking it with the rice from the beginning, this will like be soft. This fish here, when you hear of smoked fish, it's not your regular smoked fish. So look at the water that came out. Guys, be washing your fish because the smoke they use in doing this fish. So this is it. I'm going to wash it very well. And um, my onion, I finished slicing. Like, it 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 has finished boiling. It's time to wash. So let me wash the fish and the rice. So guys, I'm done washing the rice now. Let me just drain it out into the basket the filter so it can drain out the excess water right look at the rice is very clean so let's start the cooking properly so guys the pot is dry now when it's all dry all the all the water is out i will now add the red oil my heat is low so i can give enough time for the oil to I'm adding the fish now. So, guys, at this point, I've added pepper, the seasoning cube. I use none, and then I just allow it to like cook for a little while with the oil like this before I will pour water and then add the rice and allow it to cook together so that is just sakpa everything here I have the fish in my kitchen then there is onion here there is uh, seasoning here there is pepper and salt so it's just a rice you can just you know, grab it around in your kitchen so persons will add gray fish I don't have crayfish right now in my kitchen, so this is it. It's all cooked now, so you have to add. You have to add water to the level I want. 
before I pour in the rice. By now you should have tasted to see what is enough and what is not enough. You pour in the rice. Be careful it's there so you don't start pouring on that when it is not ready. So guys allow it to boil, allow it to boil. Oh guys, the rice is ready and very very hot. The smell, the aroma is all over my house. From the kitchen to the parlor to the room, anywhere you are within the house. And I'm sure my neighbors are perceiving as well. Guys, the sakwa rice is ready. It's ready guys let me know how you prepare yours guys this rice is tasty like i've tested it before i did this very part of the video it's so tasty and this fish eh, they need to work for this rice <laughs> all right guys thank you so much for watching to this point please like subscribe turn on the bell button so that day when i post more juicy content here i do vlogs cooking and motherhood series thank you and i'll see you guys in the next one till then stay amazing bye